Hey guys, welcome to a new video. Today we will be talking about Hi, I bet some of you all are wondering why this video looks so blurry. This is how me and all Egyptians view YouTube. The highest ever I go is 480p when I'm feeling bold or I like I need to see details. Normally I just watch 360. But why Mumia? There is literally a setting to go higher. Our internet here is limited. I've talked about it previously in this video. I highly recommend you watch it to get a real sense of what it's like. But if you don't have time to, I got you. I'll recap real quick. Internet here is limited by monthly quotas. For example, the package I'm on is 250 gigabytes a month, including streams, uploads, gaming, chat, all of it at a not so great speed also. Once you've used up those 250 gigabytes, you are switched to unlimited use, but with a very throttle speed, supposedly 250 kilobytes per second or something around that. This is how it should be anyway. In reality, they cut our quotas at least a week before they're due for renewal to make us do it early and pay more. Regardless of our actual use, I've tracked down all my and my family's usage before on multiple months when they said it expired and it doesn't even come close to using up the entire quota. And this is not just me. This happens to everyone. Now, when it does end, your new throttle speed is actually going to be lower than 30 kilobytes per second, which is uh, might as well just cut it off entirely, it's only enough to text with a slight delay too. As for speed, it is also purposely throttled before expiry if you use too much from the same IP or service. Say you're downloading a 200 gigabyte game, the latter half of it is gonna be excruciatingly slow if you do it in one go. And I'm sure that they have some kind of throttling mechanism because the lag goes away when I turn a VPN on, so I'm sure it's something on their end. A VPN is supposed to slow your service down because of the extra rerouting, but by avoiding whatever bullshit they have set up, it ends up making it faster, ironically. This is the average person's quality of life, and this is their quality of life in the past two years. This is an Egyptian's quality of life, on a good day. This whole internet gig is just one among thousands of injustices. So, finally, the people of Egypt have had enough of this shit, and they are blowing up the hashtag. Internet Mahdud for Masr, or in English, Unlimited Internet in Egypt. And people have all agreed in unison not to renew when they cut it short and t just tough it out until it's due. We've had enough being wrong. Internet is not a luxury in this age. People work, learn, and communicate with it. It cannot be treated this way. There have been so many rumors and leaks from within their company that they are actually distraught as a result of this hashtag and the social media pressure it's making. And also people are finding more ways to expose them and fuck with them. And people from other Arabic countries, even Gaza sector and Iraq, have joined in and saying that they don't have this bullshit we have here in their war-torn countries. They live better than us. And they call Egypt Ombedonia, or mother of the world in English. But I digress. I'm definitely hopping on this train. I'm using my platform to share this with anyone I can to expose these <laughs> showing our basic rights for extra money. This the Minister of Communication said internet is like other services and providing it without limitation means extra costs. That is bullshit of course because it is literally a thing everywhere in the world now. So if they can do it, so can you. And you don't get monthly quotas and water, do you? So how is it like other services? Also, the government dug around and found whoever started this hashtag and detained him. Which is... The dumbest thing to do. And it's not even gonna be effective. Nobody even knew who this man was before this. It isn't an organized militia with a recognized leader. This is a social outrage. So, when my quota inevitably gets cut short this month, I'm already at 75%, the warning they gave me. And it's like, still got 10 more days to go or something like that. When that happens, I'm not going to renew it. I'm gonna wait until it's due. I'm gonna do my part. And I'm curious what other ways the people come up with to fuck with them and screw them over. I'm really genuinely hoping this can make a change for the better this is such a basic thing and like the fact that we have to fight so hard for something like this is just it's miserable it shows how terrible it has become here and for no good reason either the bitches have the means to do it they just don't want to give up the extra illicit money they make from it this greedy is talking out of his head. i know the whole world is struggling right now but this is not unreasonable at all to ask if you agree with this message kindly support it by hitting up the hashtag on twitter in english or arabic i'll drop both in the description so you can just copy and paste it.
thanks. Final thing for you before I go, I have a Discord server now. If you want to come chat and hang out with me and some of my viewers, you're more than welcome. It's a lot of fun and I hope to see you all there. Till next time, take care. Nice.